Hey everybody, it's early morning on a Monday morning um, and we, uh, my son doesn't have school technically on Mondays, it's kind of ridiculous, but it's a day where we can, it's raining. So we are going to start making cookies. I've never made homemade sugar cookies before. So we'll see how they turned out. We had a good luck with the chocolate chip last weekend. So we feel a little confident. So we're gonna start this. It takes a couple hours to get everything to chill. So I'm just kind of laying out the ingredients. So check back with us later on and we'll see if we have a finished product. Hey everybody, we are made the sugar cookies are in the fridge chilling for a couple hours. But in the meantime, we're gonna do some chocolate chip cookies. So we're at the point now where we're going to start just kind of blending stuff. We've got all the ingredients. So we're going to see how this turns out. Okay. Ideally, you're supposed to let the butter sit out, but I cheated and put it in the microwave for a little bit. So that's kind of nice. that's what I find that if you don't get it blended really well, your butter chunks, it doesn't taste very good. Okay, they're in the oven, so a couple hours later we'll display all our cookies. Just got them out of the oven. I'm going to taste test one to make sure they're done because I have a habit of making them either undone or burning. So hopefully they taste okay. They... Oh, pretty good. So we are done with the chocolate chip cookies and they are cool and we're going to give some of them away. And later on we're going to do the sugar cookies. We've got our dough for the sugar cookies out of the fridge. And I'm a little skeptical on it because I still see chunks of butter in here. So I'm hoping it will be okay. I tried to, tried to stir it as much as I could, but I don't know if I did enough. We got a, a little holly berry cut out, and I'll do my first one. Let's see how this looks. I can use anything to make a cut out. And of course, I screwed it up. Here, let me fix it. All right, these are thin, so they're only going to take eight to ten minutes. Now's the time where they have cooled. Some of them look a little burnt. I've never made homemade sugar cookies from scratch, so the consistency I might have messed up on some of them, but um, we are going to ice them.